Hey everyone, uh, welcome to my latest uh, Catan video. Uh, today I'll be bringing you uh, some ranked content as we're starting to work towards the goal of getting as high up in the world rankings as we possibly can. Uh, starting off, we have the first pick, so let's have a look and see what the board is giving us today. Uh, immediately I can see that there's barely any sheep uh, and a ton of wheat. So, I think uh, that all the ore is clumped together as well, meaning that if we don't take some ore now, we probably aren't going to get any on the way back, which is kind of annoying. So, let's have a look at these spots. Look, the 639, it's a good spot. You're right near that ore port. That's probably what I'm thinking. This 5810 is not bad either, but there's just a lot of wheat and wood on the board, so we'll probably get some of that on the way back. Uh, as I said, there's barely any sheep. Like the only sheep spot me like worth considering to be honest is either the six five eleven or the 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 ten eight three and I don't want either of those. Then the nine five ten, meh. I think it's gotta be the six nine three. I just I just make sure we need to get some wood on the way back so we can make sure we can build out to this all port. But I think that's the play and we're gonna build out here. Alright. Let's see, so we've got black picking next. I think it's an, it's an interesting board because now by taking here, we've kind of cordoned off a lot of these ore spots. Like this this 5102 probably won't go. I doubt the 9102 will go. Yep, that was my probably my second choice. This 9411 isn't a bad second spot maybe for red when they pick two in a row. So I think, yeah, it's gonna be tough. 5, 8, 10, not always a good choice. High production, uh, there's a lot on the board and near two, three, four, one ports there. So, and building this way is not a bad idea because I don't think anyone's going to take this this 5, 2. Uh, and if he gets lucky and this gets left open, he has that free choice too as well. So, yep, not bad. So with red, I think this 6, 5, 11 is a good second choice. You get that free road and good production and you get some sheep. So for him... He can't get ore and wheat together, though. That's the only problem. It's going to be hard for people to get a lot of dev cards this round. Because at the moment, I'm the only one with ore. And just while we're waiting, just wanted to say thanks uh, to everyone who watched and commented and liked uh, my first video. I really appreciate the support. And I'm going to make sure I stay on top of the... Uh, the content over the coming weeks and make sure we have some consistent videos coming out, especially in the ranked space. All right, we see that red is placed. Yep, we did think that 9411 would get taken. I don't know about the 9512. Leaves himself... I suppose he gives himself everything. It's actually not a bad choice, although I don't like the two inward-facing roads. I think one of those had to go down. I mean, we'll see. It might, it might end up going all right, so... Blue, now placing, needs... Well, he's not going to go for the ore, because that's why he built this way. So I think he needs, what, brick and sheep? So probably the 611.3 or the 611.12. Either or. I think that's going to be his choice. Makes the most sense. That 6 paired with the 5 and the 10 of the wood means he'll have plenty of uh, road building to get around the board. Yep. That's what we thought. So at the moment, we just definitely need wheat. So... Look, Black's probably going to take this, but if Black doesn't take it, we're going to have to go here. Oof, that kind of hurts us a little bit. All right, let's 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 think about this. So we don't want here. That's just not not good for us. Oh, jeez, this is rough. I think at the moment this nine ten is going to be the only thing that's really going to be in of any use. Uh, it gives us the, the dual nines on the wheat and the ore, which is not bad. And it means we, because with black building inwards here, we can point the road outwards uh, over here to go towards this eight wheat uh, and then potentially come back down to get this wheat port. I think that's honestly going to be... Uh, actually, I think we point the road downwards to get on the wheat port first because black is actually blocked in here completely like unless he somehow managed to get all the way down here which he won't so he's going to eventually just go straight out here so i think 
I think we build on the 910. Yeah, I think we have to. Gives us the wheat and the wood. No one really has any sheep, so that's that's fine. And I think we build down because if we get a few nines, that wheat port could be quite valuable, actually. We start off with an eight. All right. Yep, nine. That's what we want. We love a nine. Hopefully, we can get an early city up. Uh, it'll give us some uh, good resources to trade around. Oh, geez, black just four for one for an ore and didn't do anything with it. I don't know about that. Wood for ore. No. It's tempting, but we kind of need that wood. We want to be able to get a road off to that ore port as soon as possible. There's the three. That's that's great. I think I think the ore port here is the most important thing first. Let's just go. And no need for a trade yet. We'll try and get some sheep later. It, we might have to do some either a four for one or if we roll a seven. I don't think we're gonna people are gonna give up their sheep. It's too precious at the moment. Six is good. Oh, jeez, people are... Look, it's tempting, but not right now. Oh, jeez. I... Okay. I mean, that's two devs. What does he want it for? We must, want... we must be able to road and settle here. This is tempting. See, what's more... No, I think the early city for us is the more important game here. I don't know. I don't know. You guys, tell me in the comments if you think that was a trade worth taking at that point. Yeah, that road, that let him road and settle there. That's why he wanted it, racing red. Maybe I should have taken that trade. Actually, I don't know. It might have made blue too strong too early. Being on the nine ore and more wood, I think, yeah. No, I think that's right. And it means also that by rolling a seven, it means that red's going to try and focus block blue to race him for this spot here. Uh, no, we don't want to do that. Alright, we need a six. No, nothing for us. Uh, we could try this. I don't know if we'll get anything, but... Let's see. Red's, th well, Red's thinking about it. I think we take that. I think it just gives us that city. We're on the 10 for the wood, so we should be able to get some more. Let's, yeah, let's city this 639, I think. Okay, early city. It's a good strong start, and there's the 6. Good decision. There's already a couple of devs being bought. Blue will probably rob red here, probably on the 9 ore. Yep, might steal from us, but I think he'll steal from red, just doesn't want to... They're really racing for that spot. Straight back on the 8 or the 5. Oh, geez, I don't know about that single block, to be honest. I know he's blocking blue's wood, but I just think that 8 might be better. Nothing we can do here. It, was, it might have been a better idea to city on the 910. Just because we have that all that ore production and then we're getting two wheat every time a 9 rolls. Maybe, I'm not sure. Again, let me know what you think. Black 4 for 1s. Jeez, he's 4 for 1 a couple of times. I suppose him on... Like the sheep port... It's good on the 8-3 for the brick, but the sheep port really doesn't do that much. Oh, blue gets on that nine two ten. I think blue right now is the one for, for that we need to block. Uh, we don't want to do a one for one there. Two brick. That three's hit twice already, which is nice. We just need to get some wheat, and we can see if we can trade for a sheep. Which is the two rolls for blue. I think. Five cards, we can't dev. Uh, building a road's useless. I think we hold, to be honest. I think it's just the safest thing to do. Yeah, I think that nine's always going to be blocked by black. Steals from blue. I think, again, I think he's right. I think blue is the, the bigger threat right now. 
Ooh, blue probably blocks me here. Maybe the nine wheat down here to get red as well. Not the ten. Leap. Oh, he robbed me. I thought he was going to revenge rob black. Makes sense though. He, I wonder if he was looking for something in particular then, because I don't know. I think the better double block would have been the nine. All right, come on, nine. All right, put the sheep around. Do we think we can get? Look, this is a real stretch, but do we think we can get something like this? Maybe two? It's not a bad offer. I don't know if anyone has both, is the question. Oh, six cards, and a nine could put us over, but and so could a six and three. We can't really do anything. We're kind of stuck here with a bad hand. I think we just have to wait. There's the seven. I think blue gets... Oh, he goes back on the nine again, being black. That's fine. Oh. Still some red. Six is good for us. We don't really want to be four for wanting all, but if it is what it is, that's six again. Or if we can just hold off here, we should be able to do something. All right. If we can just give up this for either this or this. All right, I think we do that with black. That just gives us that settlement on that ore port, which is huge. We do have to fall for one, but I think it is worth worth it at this stage of the game. It gives us a port and that extra settlement spot. It definitely helps us. Now we've got those two for ones. Every time those sixes and nines hits, we'll be pretty strong. Unfortunately, that six is going to be a nice little target spot. Right, we've got another road. I think now our next option is to go down for this this wheat port and get on the nines. Red's too busy trying to get in here to race us for it. I think blue wants yet yeah, the wood port. Alright, come on. We need something good here. Seven would be nice actually. Right, more wood. I think we just Yeah, I think we just build this road. And hold from there. Black's sitting out here with 11 cards. He should be able to road and settle on that 3 for 1. There's the 9. That's what we're looking for. Yeah, geez, an extra settlement down here. Or a city. I think it's going to be massive. Or oh, huge move by red. Must have been a little bit of a revenge play, to be honest, for <laughs> getting in here. I quite like that. It's a really big play by Red. All right, so we've got a couple of options here. We can hold, which I don't really like. We can two for one our ore for either a sheep or a brick and then hold. Or we can two for one for a dev. I, th I kind of think the dev might be the option here because we really want to get this robber off the six. It's just hurting us. So I think... I think that's our play. All right, let's hope for a night. Yep, perfect. Good decision, I think. Those nines keep hitting too. That's just amazing. Black three for ones. Gets on the sheep port, to be honest. The sheep port's not... Oh, there's nines again. There's another city. That's great. Can just hold out, make sure we don't go over seven here. Blue, I swear that two has hit three times already. Okay, red's looking a little dangerous. I think we don't play the knight just because we don't want to go over eight or over seven cards. Oh, the three, okay. There's a couple, okay, look, there's a, we can city or we can settle. And I think, let's play the knight, see if we can steal a sheep. I don't know if there's any out there. I think right now, Oh, I don't really know what the best square to block is here. Who's more dangerous? Probably blue. Just because he has a bit more of a dev game. Maybe this... Oh, this eight wheat. Because black gets four wheat every time an eight's rolled. I think that's the right play, and I think we steal from blue. Another ore. Oh, actually, that's kind of big. 
I think we city. Actually, you know what? I think we settle. I, I think the settle here is the better play, just in case. Now that Red's got his settlement there, we don't want to somehow get play out. I don't think it would happen, but Red's running out of settlement spots, and he really needs to. So I think this just locks that in and gives us the wheat port as well. Plus we get double nines. Yeah, I think, I think this is the right play. We could dev as well. I know an extra city sounds promising, but to be honest, I think a dev card here is the better play. Okay, I'm just hoping for a knight. Yep, we'll take it. Good turn. Oh, seven here. Straight on that nine, there goes our brick. I would think so. Oh, we stole from red. Interesting. Blue four for one through a wheat and buys another dev. Yep, I'm pretty confident he didn't have a knight there. All right, I think we definitely play this. I still think blue's the dangerous one. We can't block his nine. Blocking his five seems pointless. I think this eight again is the better block. I think we just steal from blue again. Because he has ore, and that's good for us. Okay. We're kind of stuck here. Do you think we can give up a brick for either a sheep or a wheat? Someone might want this. I think this is... I think we give this to red. Yeah, I think we give this to red. It means we can dev again. If we can snag a knight here, then we've locked in army for a little bit. So I think that's a big play. Because I think we will be the focus of the robber, at least for the next few turns. VP. Oh, I mean, it's kind of annoying, but it also... We're getting more towards the middle stages of this game, so I think it's actually not too bad. I'm just not a big fan of early VPs. Let's go straight back on that nine. Straight deal from us, which is fair enough. Three. It's lovely. That's right. I think him having to four for one and use all his cards then was, was worth the port. Alright, we'd love a six or a nine here. Oh, Red gets another city up. Alright. Six or nine, or even seven. That eight, that eight is massive for black. Jeez, he, he probably kicking himself then he just got some three sheep. Black will be able to get his first city up. We just got to be careful of black coming over the top here. There's the six. That's what we want. Six is great for us because it only gives these guys a brick. Yeah, black and red coming over the top here. I think we really need to... I know we can city on this next turn, but let's not. I think we have to lock in the robber. Uh, the Sorry, the army. And get that, get that robber off our nine. Ouch. Let's get rid of the brick. Okay. There's not any good double blockable squares for us. Like this eight, sure. But then it gets red off scot-free. This six is not worth it. This four, maybe. I still think we have to go here. And I think we steal from black this time. Maybe get... Who got the wheat? Black. I think we go with black. Hopefully we can snag a wheat here. Some more brick. Okay, I think we're just two for one and we really need a knight this turn. Alright. Come on. That's what we'd like. Okay. We can lock in army, get to eight points, and then all we really need to do is either city city or settle city, and we're good. I'm convinced blue has a VP, or maybe he's holding onto a mono. Oh, that just proved me wrong. That is okay, though. I think, yeah, blue's the one to block here. We really need to get another dev in the pocket, too, because he is challenging us for army. Oh, jeez. Those sixes are amazing. 
All right, I think we play this knight. I think we definitely need to block blue again, and I think just this is the right spot. Blue. More ore, that's fine with us. Ah, yep, good choice. Okay. I think we have to dev, unfortunately. We could, we could city, but I think blue's just going to rob us again, and I don't want to have to be losing a fight for army here. The other thing, too, is... We, we can take road. No one's taking it. If we could just make a sneaky play for road, we could we could win this. Oh, that VP is huge. We need to try and win next turn, I think, because blue's going to catch us with three on the next turn, I'd be likely to say. Oh, I hate these positions. We're going to get focused with the robber too, which is fair enough. So they'll go on six. Nope, nine. But it'll steal from me. Just need three roads. Not even. Oh, just we need. To, oh, it's annoying that that nine got blocked. Oh, black's taken road. Fair enough. Oh, yep. And then we'll lose our only other ore. Ah, oh, it's frustrating. So, does blue have two knights? Potentially. Let's just hope he can't buy another dev here. We are going to lose army. I think blue's seeing if he can get a trade for. To get another dev. If black gets over here though, he'd be getting so much wheat. Oh no. Blue's going for road. Lot of seven. I won't get single blocked here. Ah. Uh, see, I get you want to block the six, but he gets nothing from that. I, I'm just, I don't know. I don't know about that. I suppose he can't really double block me anywhere other than the, the 3 or the 10. It's not worth it for him. Oh, that 8. Nothing we can do. Just pass. I think if Blue has a 9, he plays it here. Because he has to go up ahead. It would make the most sense. Even though it's not on him, it just makes the most sense. Yep, there's the dev. I don't think he has a knight. That could have been it, though. Oh, year of plenty. Yep, he's connecting that road. We better tell people to... Blue on eight points. <sighs> people just love getting called out. <laughs> Uh, we don't want to do that trade. I mean, I am on nine points. He's got a very valid point. Uh, but, you know, if he's, I think he is on eight points and all he needs to do is buy another dev. He's also just killed Black's road game. So, Black's, uh, Black and Red are pretty much out of this. I think it's only Blue and I at the moment. It's funny though, just a little bit of table talk there immediately threw red to put that rubber on, on blue when, to be honest, I think it's a bit it's a bit of a 50-50. A couple of good rolls here and we're, we're looking pretty... Unfortunately, we're not getting the dice. I think we just pass. I mean, that 10 is barely rolled. Blue just currently has a lot of road building. He's got three... Blue's just got five wood, and he's only on a three for one port, so we can't really do much with that. Ooh. See, to me, that's a silly road placement from Black. I get that he's trying to extend here, but I think he... Maybe, I... Maybe I'm wrong, but I thought I would have gone in here and looped it around, but that's interesting. Blue literally has seven wood. I think that table talk and getting getting red to block blue is, is big. Well, we need now is a couple of sixes and we win this. And I know it's hard and people will not 
do it. And a lot, of, a lot of games I sit here and no one talks in the chat, but I think it's a big part of this game, like especially when you can't talk to people face-to-face, that I think there's time and a place to get in the chat and say something and it can really turn a game. Yeah, Blue's going to have to fight for road here, which for us is huge. We literally need one roll now and it's it's game over. Just need one roll. Nine, six. Uh, now I can. All right, that's the nine. Those nines were huge. That is a GG. And a big boost in points. 23. Very happy with that. Good solid win. Let's have a look at these stats. Uh, blue's just out here. Giving it to red. I mean, I told you that table talk was just was great. 10 points. We had good resource production. Uh, and uh, blue technically had the best resource score at the end of the day. Uh, we did get... Us two got robbed the most. Let's have a look at these dev cards. The one Monopoly drawn. Hang on, does that mean the blue was holding... Oh, Blue was holding the Monopoly. Ooh, that's interesting. Okay. Well, there we go. Happy with that. Let's just have a quick look at these leaderboards. So, as I was saying earlier, I really want to go up in the global rankings. I'm only sitting at 11.53 after that game. Uh, earlier this season, I did get as high as about 160, but we had a bit of a bad run, so it's good to get back on the, uh, the winner's list today. Uh, and always, uh, thanks everyone for watching. I really appreciate it. And yeah, please put any tips or things you liked or didn't like or would like to see in the comments. And yeah, like and subscribe if you enjoy this kind of content. And we'll hope to see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.